नमस्कार आज मैं क्लास एट को साइंस एंड टेक्नोलॉजी यूनिट टेन मेट्रियल्स यूज इन डेली लाइफ को टेन पॉइंट वन एसिड बेस एंड साल्ट को लेसन लीर आक कम्प्लीट द फलोइंग एसिड्स गिव हाइड्रोजन आय बाय डिजल्विंग इन वाटर एसिड्स चेंज ब्लू लिटमस पेपर इन टू रेड बेसिस दैट आर सोलबल इन वाटर आर कल्ड एल्कलाई पी एच मीटर इज एन इलेक्ट्रोनिक डिवाइस दैट इज यूज टू एक्सप्रेस द पी एच वैल्यू अफ एसिड एंड बेस Salt is formed by partial or total displacement of hydrogen ions from acids by metals. What happens when dilute sulfuric acid reacts with zinc? When dilute sulfuric acid reacts with zinc, zinc sulfate and hydrogen gas are produced. The word equation for this reaction is zinc plus sulfuric acid gives zinc sulfate plus hydrogen. Zn plus H2SO4 gives ZnSO4 plus H2. What happens when dilute hydrochloric acid reacts with sodium bicarbonate? When dilute hydrochloric acid reacts with sodium bicarbonate, sodium chloride, water, and carbon dioxide are produced. The balanced chemical equation for this reaction is sodium bicarbonate plus hydrogen hydrochloric acid gives sodium chloride plus water plus carbon dioxide. NaHCO3 plus HCl gives NaCl plus H2O plus CO2. Few drops of methyl orange are added to grape juice. Methyl orange will turn red in the solution. Magnesium oxide is dissolved in water. When magnesium oxide is dissolved in water, it forms magnesium hydroxide. The word equation and balanced chemical equation are magnesium oxide plus water gives magnesium hydroxide, MgO plus H2O, MgOH2. Acid reacts with base. When an acid reacts with a base, they form a salt and water. This is known as neutralization reaction. The word equation and a general example are word equation. Acid plus base gives salt plus water. Example, hydrochloric acid plus sodium hydroxide gives sodium chloride plus water. HCl plus NaOH gives NaCl plus H2O. Red litmus comes in contact with soap. When red litmus paper comes in contact with soap, it turns blue. This indicates that soap is a basic substance. Complete the following table. There are four indicators. So blue indicators, blue sorry, blue litmus paper becomes red in acid, no change in base and no change in salt. Red litmus paper, no change in acid, blue in base and no change in salt. Methyl orange becomes red in acid, yellow in base and no change in salt. Phenolphthalein becomes colorless in acid, becomes pink in base and no change in salt. Answer the following questions. What is an acid? Give four examples. An acid is a substance that typically donates a proton or accepts a pair of electrons in a chemical reaction. Here are four examples of acids. Hydrochloric acid, sulfuric acid, acetic acid, and citric acid. Write any two physical properties of acid. Two physical properties of acids. Taste. Acids generally have a sour taste. Texture, acids are typically corrosive to metals and can cause burns on skin. What is a base? Give four examples. A base is a substance that can accept protons or donate pairs of electrons in a chemical reaction. Bases typically increase the concentration of hydrogen ions, sorry, hydroxide ions in aqueous solution. Examples of bases, sodium hydroxide, potassium hydroxide, calcium hydroxide and magnesium hydroxide. Write any three physical properties of bases. Three physical properties of bases are bases have a bitter taste, bases feel slippery or soapy to touch, bases can conduct electricity when dissolved in water. All alkalis are bases but all bases are not alkalis. Why? Water soluble bases are called alkalis and there are bases which are not soluble in water. Therefore all alkalis are bases but all bases are not alkalis. Write any two chemical properties of acid and base. Here are two chemical properties of acid and bases. Acids. Acids react with, with bases to form salt and water in neutralization reaction. Acids react with metals to produce hydrogen gas. Bases. Bases react with acids to form salt and water in a neutralization reaction. Bases react with fats and oil in a process called saponification to produce glycerol and soap. What is salt? How do you prepare salt? Salt is a chemical compound composed of positively charged ions and negatively charged ions. It forms through the reaction between an acid and a base known as neutralization. P 
Preparation of salt Neutralization reaction Salt is prepared by reacting an acid with a base During the reaction the hydrogen ions from the acid combine with the hydrogen ions from the base to form water while the remaining ions form the salt For instance if hydrogen hydrochloric acid reacts with sodium hydroxide the resulting salt is sodium chloride commonly known as table salt What is an indicator? Write the names of any three indicators that are used in laboratory An indicator is a substance that changes color depending on the pH of a solution providing a visual indication of the pH level Three indicators used in the laboratory phenolphthalein methyl orange universal indicator If a solution is given to you how will you determine whether it is an acid or base or salt To determine whether a solution is an acid base or salt acid Test with a pH indicator like phenolphthalein or methyl orange. If the indicator changes color to indicate acidity, the solution is acidic. Base. Test with pH indicator. If the indicator changes color to indicate alkalinity, the solution is basic. Salt. Salts are typically neutral in pH. Test with a pH indicator. If the indicator shows a neutral pH, the solution is likely a salt. Phenolphthalein is not a suitable indicator for acid test why phenolphthalein is not suitable for testing acids because it is colorless in acidic solutions making it difficult to distinguish acid from neutral ones write short notes on indicator an indicator is a pure substance who used to determine the acidity or basicity of a solution by changing color at different ph levels it provides a visual way to identify whether a solution is acidic basic or neutral For example, litmus paper turns red in acidic solutions and blue in basic ones, while phenolphthalein remains colorless in acidic solutions and turns pink in basic ones. Methyl orange turns red in acidic solutions and yellow in basic solutions. Indicators are essential tools in chemistry for performing experiments and testing the pH of various substances. Alkali. An alkali is a type of base that is soluble in water forms hydroxide ions when dissolved. Alkalis typically have a bitter taste and a slippery feel. They can neutralize acids to form salts and water. Common examples of alkalis include sodium hydroxide also known as caustic soda and potassium hydroxide also known as caustic potash. Alkalis are widely used in various applications such as cleaning products, soap making and chemical soap making and chemical manufacturing. Universal indicator a universal indicator is a mixture of several indicators that provide a color change across a wide range of pH values allowing the determination of the pH level of solution unlike single indicators that change color at a specific pH a universal indicator shows a gradual change of colors over a broad pH spectrum typically from red to violet with green indicating a neutral pH around 7 pH chart a pH chart is a visual tool that displays the pH scale which ranges from 0 to 14 representing the acidity or basicity of a solution the chart shows different colors corresponding to different pH levels red for strongly acid orange to yellow for weakly acidic green for neutral and blue to purple for basic it helps users quickly determine the ph of solution by comparing the color of a ph indicator or universal indicator solution to the colors on the chart ph value a ph value is a numerical measure of the acidity or basicity of a solution ranging from 0 to 14 a ph value of 7 is considered neutral indicating a balance between hydrogen ions and hydroxide ions in the solution values between 7 indicate acidity with lower numbers representing strong acids values above 7 indicate basicity with higher numbers representing stronger bases acidic salt an acidic salt is a type of salt that re- results from the neutralization of a strong acid and a weak base in solution acidic salts can hydrolyze to produce additional hydrogen ions making the solution acidic an example of an acidic salt is ammonium chloride which is formed from the hydrochloric acid and ammonia when dissolved in water it releases ammonium ions and chloride ions the ammonium ions can further react with water to produce hydrogen ions resulting in an acidic solution draw a ph chart and show particular colors in the particular columns the colors from 0 to 14 is shown in the color chart ph chart so ph 0 to 1 is red 
two to three orange four to five yellow six yellow green seven green which is neutral eight to nine blue green to light blue ps10 blue ps11 dark blue ps12 indigo ps13 purple and ps14 violet what happens when acid reacts with base when an acid reacts with a base a chemical reaction is a chemical reaction known as neutralization occurs the general products of this reaction are salt and water the reaction can be represented by following equation acid plus base gives salt plus water sodium oxide reacts with water when sodium oxide reacts with water it forms sodium hydroxide Na2O plus H2O gives two NaOH hydrochloric acid reacts with potassium hydroxide when hydrochloric acid reacts with potassium hydroxide they undergo a neutralization reaction to produce potassium chloride and water hcl plus koh gives kcl plus h2o sodium reacts with sulfuric acid when sodium reacts with sulfuric acid the following reaction occurs sodium plus sulfuric acid gives sodium sulfate plus hydrogen thank you so much for watching my channel please do like and subscribe and comment so that i can make my channel more good and more uh, useful for you guys thank you